Hey, hey everyone, Angela O'Hare here, your favorite Las Vegas realtor. And today I'm doing a model home tour over here in Carmel Cliff by Pulte in the Red Point Village. As you can see, they're still under construction. They recently released maybe a month or two the model homes, but they had been selling for a little bit before the model homes came into play. I'm taking a tour of this Pacero model. There are four floor plans to choose from and only three of them are modeled here. So this Pacero model, let me get my little sheet. I love this entryway. So it's a three car garage, obviously. There's that and then that is the second to small or largest model at 3942 square feet with five beds, four and a half baths and a three car garage. As of today, which is September 9th, the base price of this home is at 1 mil 89880. Now that could change depending on when you watch this video, it could be higher. And don't forget this is just the base price which does not include any upgrades or lot premium. And depending on where your lot is, that premium can be 100,000, 200,000, maybe 50. So I really like this floor plan too, the nice little dining room with the same wine fridge area or wine cooler in the background. And then you have this nice little den. Looks like this could be converted into a bedroom because it does have a closet. And it's a very good sized closet. I like this room. I really like this quartz. I like the little black gray veining, very nice. And then right there is access to the garage. Let's see what this is. Looks like it's the half bath. Not a fan of the design, but who am I, right? So as you come in, you have really, really high ceilings, the beautiful light fixture, the stairs to the right. Look at that fireplace. It's the same quartz countertops as in the office with a dark brown flat panel cabinets, sub-zero refrigerator, and this is an interesting quartz right here. Let's see what the appliances are. Whirlpool. So, you know, obviously it may come with Whirlpool. This could be the upgraded appliance package. I'm not sure at the moment with the microwave and an oven. A lot of these model homes probably have 500,000, if not more in upgrades, up to probably a million dollars. I know Toll Brothers, especially at Mesa Ridge, their model homes have at least at least a million dollars in upgrades. Oh, okay, there's something back there. I like this though, this is very cute. And entry to the two car garage. This is, I don't know if this is the primary or if it's just a secondary bedroom downstairs. Yeah, I think it's a secondary. Yeah, you can tell by the bathroom. And this has the flat um, shower, which is an extra cost. Normally it would probably come with the builder grade tub. And if you add a shower, that's an additional cost. And we'll take a look outside after we finish up. Take a peek upstairs. Let's get an overview. You and your field manager will celebrate the tour of the completed house to examine the quality and care that's built in. Your field manager will show you how to operate everything you Wow, that's interesting. It's probably an upgrade. Okay, as you come up, looks like you have a bedroom, we'll tear that last. And then a nice loft area. Then it's time to 
Let's keep on going back first. This room seemed pretty large. I mean, it should be. It's at almost a 4,000 square foot house. Closet. The first model, I do believe, though, had almost a bathroom in every bedroom. Interesting. Don't know how I feel about that. Especially, <laughs> you have to be someone really tall. That's maybe why they have these things to see. <laughs> That was not a very good design choice, in my opinion. Huh, this looks like Star Wars. A Star Wars room or something. Very cute. Another walk-in closet. Okay, time for the primary. Another wet bar. At least the toilets are separated. Then you have the separate his and her, 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 him, and him sinks. And then the nice soaker tub freestanding in front of this beautiful big window that has awesome views. You can't really see very well though. And then the interesting shower. Most of the homes nowadays, especially in the primary, which this is good, it has a tub and a large walk-in closet. And another walk-in closet, so that's great. Two large, good-sized walk-in closets. So let's do an overview this way of the bedroom. And then we're gonna go on, this one also has a patio. Good size patio. Look at that. They're building. Fortunately, just because of the view, you really can't, or the fires that are going on, you really can't see it. Let's look at the backyard. I don't think there's a pool back here. That's amazing. A pool? No pool? What? Okay. So that is it. Make sure I lock everything. So let's surmise this tour. I'm over here on Carmel Cliff uh, by Pulte in the Summerlin village of Red Point and touring the Pacero. Oh, I forgot we got one more bedroom. Touring the Pacero model at 3942 square feet with five bedrooms, four and a half bathrooms and a three car garage. And the laundry room. And then the last bedroom. This is cute, not my style, but another great walk-in closet, plenty of storage. Looks like corkboard. Hmm. Oh, this one has its own bathroom too. That's very nice. This is a builder grade uh, Petrofina that comes with the home. And this is probably what the tubs look like, the basic package that comes with the house. Now, if you do buy new construction and you buy a home, I would at least get, and you don't like tubs, I would at least get one tub. I mean, obviously, us women, we still like to take baths, but at least for resale purposes, I would at least have one tub for people that have kids. Just food for thought when you're buying new construction. And you know, it's an, actually an upgrade to add a standing shower in most of the homes and the other secondary bathrooms. Anyways, if you're thinking about buying new construction here in Las Vegas, Summerlin, I am your new home construction expert. You can always give me a call, 702-370-5112. As always, like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next one.